All right, time to don my bee suit in order that the bees do not sting me, although my skin is nearly impervious to stings from the bees. I still get a suit on and don't want others, other beekeepers to feel bad about their lack of lack of abilities. Doesn't quite fit as well as it used to, but that's okay. It's gained several pounds of pure muscle. Pure muscle. M m mostly pure muscle. One must be careful not to catch one's mustache in the zipper. Where did those bees go? Where did they go to? Ah, there we go. There's the hives. Let's go over to the other one. Ah, my little winged friends, we meet again. I've come to you today not to disturb your domiciles. Of course I would never do that. I only like to steal your honey when the fall comes along. Hmm, yes, you're doing very well, I see that. Oh, yes, soon your hives will be stacked like skyscrapers. Ah, oh, immaculate. Good work. You know, gathering honey and building comb with the same fastidious that I impart to my own scientific endeavors. <sighs> Even though you are very small creatures, very small brains, magnificent stingers, I can relate to you. Ah, Sebastian Eugene Bartholomew knows a thing or two about hard work. I thought I would share some of my vital poetry as you go about your work. Maybe you can take a nectar break <laughs> and enjoy something from my fine collection of vital poetry. Oh, hello there. I was just talking to my friends, the bees. I can relate to them, but I, I don't think you would understand. I was about to read to them some vital poetry. Oh, oh yes, you are welcome. You are very welcome to listen as well. I'm sure you would enjoy it. Are you ready? Here goes. Hmm, let me see. These gloves prohibit easy access to this book here. Hold on. Let's see how to do this. Take off these wicked gloves. Ah, glorious. Well, it tastes a bit like tomato soup, which is what I had for dinner last night. Oh, it is only fitting that we read a poem about honeybees, since we are in the bee yard. I've written something new. Yes, it is a haiku. In fact, there are two haikus. Here's the first one. Buzzing honeybee, you work so hard all summer. So I can eat sweets. <laughs> oh, those bees are so busy, but I will take that honey in the end. Here is the second bee poet. Friendly honey bee. Parasites feed on your brood. Less honey for me. That's a haiku about less honey because of varroa mites. A major honey pest. It's like a giant tick feasting, <sighs> making you weak, bringing in less honey for my belly. For real, University Extension has information to help you with beekeeping. Check out the links in the description for extension resources. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel or follow us on Twitter and Instagram. Thanks.